But first, tonight we are hearing from the family after a man was killed and his body dumped near a local lake. The victim's daughter ultimately finding him near one of their favorite fishing holes. Glad you're with us tonight. I'm Matt Austin. And I'm Ginger Gadsden. News 6's Molly Reed has more from the family and the technology they use to help lead them to the site. I swear that the testimony is the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. Eighteen-year-old Johnny Santiago facing a Lake County judge today, accused of getting in a pursuit and shootout with deputies there on Monday. But soon, Volusia County Sheriff Mike Chitwood says he will also face charges here for the murder of his father, Juan. So you have everything that's placed charging with murder. Investigators say the father and son got in an argument Sunday while on the phone with Johnny's mother and Juan's wife. They say she heard arguing, gunshots, then the line went dead. Detectives arrived at this Deltona home on Lehigh Drive and found blood, DNA tests tracing it back to Juan. They told surrounding agencies to look for Johnny in a Ford F-150. That's when Lake County spotted him on Monday and the pursuit and shootout unfolded. Volusia deputies then started searching for Juan's body, but say it was the family who found him in Lake Avalon near Winter Garden on Thursday afternoon. John used to go there because he would like to take his son there to go fishing just to look at the water. Juan's brother, Justo Burgos, tells me his son and Juan's daughter used a family tracking app they found on Johnny's mother's phone, an app the sheriff's office was still working to collect data to. It was the app that got us close to that area. The rest of it was footwork. Deputies say he was found in bushes well off the beaten path. Because nobody would ever saw him. You wouldn't see him from the road. He had to go down a long, winding dirt road, cross a large field. Burgess says it was Juan's daughter who ultimately found him. My niece saw the clothing. She identified him. It was the shoes that she bought him for Father's Day. So she knows damn well that was her father. That was Molly Reed reporting. Johnny Santiago is being held in Lake County Jail on no bond for the fleeing, eluding, and attempted murder of officers' charges. As far as the murder charges in Volusia, the sheriff's office is reportedly wrapping up the case to hand it to the state attorney's office, who will then determine those charges.